Good evening, my friends. One of the most important things in life is to understand that you come here for the experience. You come here to have the satisfaction of dealing in a body of matter with the things of matter. And it is very important to realize that while you are on the earth plane, you have got to live the earth life. You have got to experience as much as you can of the different circumstances of earth. It is a very good thing to have your mind set upon spiritual matters, providing that you take your responsibilities of earth seriously and realize that they are the most important thing for you at the present time. We want you to be a balanced people. We want you to enjoy your life upon earth, to look for the good that there is around you, to look for the beauty that there is in nature, to look for the love and the companionship of others, to look for the good in other people instead of the bad. And at the same time, we want you to devote just a short portion of each day to the things of the spirit. Because you are spiritualists, you have such knowledge that other people have no idea of. You are very privileged to be able to link up with spirit, even if you are not aware of the of all that comes to you from spirit. There are many things in life that you have to undertake that you do not feel happy about. But you have got to remember that because they are of the earth, as you are of the earth, they have got to be done. You cannot go through life on earth, living, trying to live in a spirit world. You have got to live in the earthly conditions, dealing with earthly affairs. Because you are spiritualists, you have the knowledge of the reality of spirit life. You have the certainty that when you are finished with your body upon earth, you will go forward into another existence. You are leaving behind just the tools with which you have shaped your character with which you have developed your personality. You know that in many previous lives you have had experiences. Some of them you remember vaguely. One or two may stand out clearly in your minds, but others seem to have gone. But they are still there. They are still within you, the lessons which you have learned in previous lives. And when you come to our side of life, then you will see for yourself the impressions that you have made. You will see the development that you have achieved while you have been on the earth plane. You will see the physical conditions that you have come through and you will see the state of your spirituality. Remember, you came to earth of your own free will. You accepted the limitations of your life upon earth of your own free will. Because in facing these particular difficulties, in overcoming the various obstacles that are in your pathway, in learning to get on with other people, 
in making bonds of friendship and love with people on the earth plane. These are all developing your character. These are all a part of what you came to earth to do. It is impossible for you to live in an earth body and achieve victories the whole way through your life. You are bound to have failures at times. You are bound to slip from the ideals which you have in your mind. You are bound to commit sins, if you like to call them that, of various things. Because of the limitations of the earth plane, the limitations of your earth body, your earth mind. But it doesn't matter if you fail. It doesn't matter if you fall short of what you have hoped to have achieved. If you can pick yourself up again and carry on. If you can try to learn from the mistakes that you have made. Remembering that if you do wrong to other people, you will have a chance to set it right. If not in this world, then when you come to ours. Life on earth is not easy. It never has been and it never will be. But during the time that you are here, we want you to make the most of the opportunities that come your way. We want you to show to others love, sympathy, concern. We do not want you to condone evil, but we want you to realize that every negative has a positive and that every positive has a negative. And it is the union of the two that make, will make up the whole. Take your journey through life. Do what you can each day to spread a little happiness among the people with whom you come into contact. Look upon earth as being a school in which your soul is learning and developing. Because you have found your way into spiritualism, remember that you have moved out of the lower classes and you are starting in the higher ones. There is much in your world that we would like to see altered. And yet we know that in its own way, your earth is achieving what it was intended to. It is a, a school in which the souls are being taught, are being moulded, are being guided. Remember that you can awaken within someone else the longing for peace, for friendship, for love, and that those are the most important things, both in your world and in ours. Good night, my friends, and God bless you all. Thank you.